If enough force is applied to any bone, it'll break. The skull, as strong as it is, is no exception. A fracture of the orbital globe is a common blunt force injury of the skull. When an object hits the orbital bones, the force continues through the bones, causing them to buckle and break. Commonly, blowouts are caused by motor vehicle accidents, balls in sports, fists, and elbows. The orbit of the skull is made up of six bones, the frontal, the zygomatic, the maxillary, the sphenoid, the ethmoid, and the lacrimal. These bones protect what's inside the orbit. The orbit's components include the eye, extraocular muscles, arteries, veins, and nerves. The orbit's also broken up into four boundaries, the superior wall, the medial wall, the lateral wall, and the orbital floor. These walls are surrounded by the sinuses. The sinuses are hollow pockets of air in the skull, making it much lighter. The four pairs of sinuses are the frontal sinuses, the maxillary sinuses, the sphenoid sinuses, and the ethmoid sinuses. Orbital floor fractures are the most common, mainly due to the floor's structural disadvantage sitting thin and flat over the hollow maxillary sinus. Common symptoms of an orbital blowout fracture include bruising, swelling, and soreness around the eye. The more severe cases of trauma can result in facial bone fractures, double vision, and injuries to the eye, skull, and brain. Doctors will often prescribe steroids to reduce swelling and antibiotics to prevent infection. Severe orbital fractures with ongoing symptoms are usually candidates for surgical repair. Otherwise, fractures typically heal with no long-term lasting effects.